بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ویلکم ٹو مائی انیدر ویڈیو سیریز آن انڈرویڈ ایپ ڈیولپمنٹ سو گائز ان دیس ویڈیو سیریز آئی ویل ٹیچ یو ہاو ٹو یوز دی ہیر ایس ڈی کے فور انڈرویڈ آرائیٹ سو وی ویل بیسکلی یوز دی ہیر ایس ڈی کے اینڈ آئی ویل ٹیچ یو فرام اے بی سی اے ٹو زیڈ اوکے سو لیٹس گیٹ سٹارٹیڈ سو ہیر فرسٹ آف آل وی ہیو ٹو کریئٹ ا پروجیکٹ نیم وی کین سے اٹ مائک ہیر میپ ایس ڈی کے آر وائٹ سو ہیر فرام ہیر وی کین کریئٹ آر پروجیکٹ اینڈ یو ہیو ٹو اوپن دی ہیر ویب سائٹ اوکے so and you have to create an account and after the, you create an account uh, you will uh, get this page okay so here what you can do let me open it again okay so now you will be here and here you have to uh, click here generate app id and app uh, apps code all right so uh, here you have to enter your here you have to enter your package name then your app id and the application code and the lessons key will be uh, will be generated so you have to copy them in your android project all right so as you guys can see we have this project so first of all let me change it to linear layout and let me remove that okay so what we can do here uh, let me uh, create another project okay so we have uh, this uh, page ready so what here we can do we have to cl uh, click on here generate app id and icon okay so here we have to write our package name so uh, you have to go to your uh, manifest file and you have to copy your package name and you have to paste that here and click on generate in the meanwhile i show you the how to integrate your hair dot sdk this is the documentation all right so here uh, uh, as you guys can see here they have this uh, download sdk so uh, as i have already downloaded the sdk so what uh, here is the sdk let me show you okay so you have to open that and you have to click on libs and here you have to extract it okay so i extract extracted it to my desktop let me show you okay so here we have this so we have to uh, import that to our android project so how can we uh, import it So for that you have to go on file uh, project structure and in here you have to click on plus and for here you have to click on import jar or double uh, ar package and here from here you can select the double ar or archive file so you have to go to your desktop here you can find your uh, archive file all right and we have to click on finish and you have to click on app go to dependency and in here you have to add the module dependency and click ok and now click ok
otherwise so now the project uh, synchronization is finished so we have successfully inserted and integrated our uh, archive file so the next step is we have to copy that and we have to go to our build dot gradle and here you have to copy that and after that what you need to do is you need to co uh, use the hardware accelerated to do so you have to go to your manifest file and let me first of all synchronize it and here you have to do hardware accelerated to true so now the next step here is we have to add the permissions so we can copy the permissions and we can add the permissions here and now the next step is we have to copy that code and paste it after the activity is closed all right so we have to go to here and uh, we have to copy that this is now very important so you have to copy uh, paste that here and so here you can you have this app id app code and the license key so you have to copy that so first of all let me copy the app id alright now we have to copy our app code and finally we have to copy the license key alright so now our uh, SDK is successfully integrated so the next step here is we have to uh, we have to you copy the fragment or we have to use the fragment map frag fragment basically so just copy that and paste it here ok so we have this uh, map fragment so we have to go to our main activity and let's start writing the call to, to display the map so first of all we have to create a map object ok so here you have to select this one here SDK map alright and we need a map fragment map fragment and we have to first of all initialize the map fragment Let's map fragment set fragment manager so find fragment by id order id dot map fragment alright so we have initialized it so the next step is we have to initialize the so we have to initialize it so we can say map fragment dot init and in here we have to write new on engine yeah, in it listener and so in here we have to write the code so let me show you here that we have to use the if condition okay so here we have to use the if the error is none so here what we can do is we can say map equals to map fragment dot get map ok so now we are storing the, ma uh, the map into our uh, map object so now we can say map dot set center ok so here we have to provide uh, geo coordinate so we can say new geo coordinate and in here we have to provide the, la the latitude and the longitude and the altitude so here we can say 49 point any uh, you can use any longitude and the longitude one nine six two one and minus two three dot double zero 
four double seven two and thirty. And the other two coordinates will be zero point zero. And we have to use map so let me see that so here we have to use map dot animation okay so map dot animation dot bow okay and we have to set the zoom map dot set zoom level and here you can see map dot set zoom level plus map dot get minimum zoom level divided by two Alright, so now our code is uh, finished, so we have to run it. So first of all, let me open this hyperlink. So guys, let me connect my Android phone. So guys, uh, the my smartphone is up and running, and we have to see the output. Okay, so here we have can say if else that application context map could not be loaded. Alright, so now the application is getting installed in my smartphone. So as you guys can see, there is no display because my uh, internet is off so we I open my data okay network and so now when we open yeah okay so we have to enable the uh, location so we have to go to our application because uh, it's marshmallow So we have to give the permission. Let's see the permission first. So we don't have the permission here, so we need to add the permission. Access find location. Cost location. All right. So now we have to uninstall it, and we have to run it again. So you guys 
latency map could not be loaded so we have to give access to the our app So what is the problem here? I don't know. So when you click Okay guys so I will show you the output in my next video If you like the video please subscribe to me